We're going to work through a similar example to the previous video, but this time we're working out the equation of the normal. Okay, so the curve we in the curve in question, sorry, is y is equal to x cubed minus 2x squared. So we find dy by dx first. So dy by dx will be 3x squared minus 4x. I then evaluate the gradient function when x is minus 1. So dy by dx when x is equal to minus 1 is equal to 3 lots of minus 1 squared. Take away 4 lots of minus 1. So we have 3 lots of 1 take away 4 lots of minus 1. So we've got 3 plus 4 and so that's 7. Okay, so that is the gradient of the tangent at x equals minus 1. Okay, so the gradient of the normal, or rather, if I write the equation of the normal, so equation of the normal is y equals, now we need to use the negative reciprocal of that, so that's minus one-seventh x plus c. So that was the gradient of the tangent. That's the gradient of the normal. Now we need to substitute in the coordinates to find c. But I don't have the coordinates. All I have is the x-ordinate. So in order to find the y-coordinate, I need to substitute this into the original curve. So y, when x is equal to minus 1, is equal to minus 1 cubed, take away 2 lots of minus 1 squared. So we get minus 1, take away 2, and so that's minus 3. So the coordinates are minus 1, minus 3. And it's these that I will substitute into the equation of the normal to find c. So minus 3 is equal to minus 1 seventh times minus 1 plus c. So I have minus 3 is equal to a seventh plus c. Now 3 is 21 sevenths, so minus 21 sevenths take away another seventh is c is equal to minus 22 sevenths. And so the equation of the normal that I want is y is equal to minus 1 seventh x minus 22 sevenths. Okay? And that is the equation of the normal.